This experience is from the Bis Tribe, where you activate your goddess pleasure by Elizabeth Ann Atkins. You can do it, goddess, because you have the power and the pleasure. Welcome to the Bis Tribe, where you activate your goddess pleasure. Right now, we're going to clear our energy with a shower of light and a sound bath, followed by a guided meditation and journaling. If you'd like to skip this introduction, you can go straight to the energy clearing meditation and journaling exercise by using the timestamps provided in the description box. We're going to use the power journal technique, which was created by two sisters writing and publishing in a series of workbooks. It involves setting an intention to ask a specific question of spirit during meditation, then journaling to write all the answers that spirit provides. Our intention with this meditation is to ask spirit to tell you what action steps you need to take to bring your dream life, your goddess vision, into 3D reality as it pertains to enjoying more pleasure in your life. So please relax and get ready to step through the goddess pleasure gateway into the life that you love. This experience is from the Bis Tribe, where you activate your goddess pleasure. It's a unique book published by Two Sisters Writing and Publishing and authored by Elizabeth Ann Atkins. That's me, a certified meditation teacher, an Emmy-nominated TV show host, a wellness coach, and creator of The Goddess Power Show with Elizabeth Ann Atkins. In the book, I'm known as Bis, leading you on a women's retreat on Infinity Mountain, where you learn how to activate your power, pleasure, prosperity, protection, and peace. Then you earn your coronation at Sea Goddess Castle. After that, you return home to build your empire that you rule from a throne of power wearing a crown of confidence. To do that, you need to use the five goddess pleasure activation tools, pranayama breathing, chakra clearing, the power journal method that combines meditation and journaling, and orgasmic visualization, which you have to read the book to learn how to do that one. You can find the video that demonstrates the pranayama breathing exercise on thegoddesspowershow.com. Just click on the page for the Goddess Power Activation Tools. Before we get started, please settle into a quiet, comfortable place where you will not be disturbed. For this exercise, you can either write on the lines provided in the Bis Tribe book, or you can get your workbook, Power Journal to Activate Your Goddess Pleasure, at twosisterswriting.com. You can also write in a notebook or journal as well as on your phone, tablet, or laptop. It's important that immediately after meditation, you write down every detail of what you learned from spirit while it's fresh in your mind and while you're in a very relaxed state. That's when ideas and images can flow freely. So please keep your book, workbook, journal, or device handy so you can journal after the meditation. We're going to start with an energy cleanse. Our bodies have seven main energy centers that play an important role in our mind, body, spirit, wellness. This network of energy centers in and around our bodies make up the chakra system, which originates in Hindu traditions. The word chakra means spinning wheel of energy in ancient Sanskrit. So think of each chakra like a heat lamp that's attached to a ceiling fan that's spinning really fast to circulate that warmth through the whole room. The cleaner the blades are, the faster the fan can spin, and the more brightly the light can glow and radiate its energy. Since each chakra rules a different aspect of your being, you want all of them on the fastest and brightest settings. So imagine each chakra as a ball of light. 
our goal is to clear away the negative energy that accumulates during the day, over a lifetime, and even during past lives in the form of pain, trauma, anxiety, and stress. This energy dims the light like smog, smudges, and imprints. This internal power system can turbocharge your quest to manifest your goddess life. And if you don't do regular cleaning and maintenance, you could be holding toxic energy that blocks your connection to spirit and causes discomfort, disease, and even death. Clearing your energy centers every day is like showering to remove dirt from your body and it helps create a clear channel to spirit so that you can easily access the divine guidance that's required to activate your goddess pleasure. So let's get started. Sit with your spine straight, close your eyes and become very aware of your breath, your face and your body. Notice any tension in your forehead, your jaw, your neck, your back, and anywhere else. Then envision those muscles as if they're butter, growing warmer and softer, melting away all tension into a warm, sweet flow circulating through your body. Now let's set the intention to clear our energy, get into a deeply relaxing state of meditation, connect with the divine, and learn the guidance that we need to bring our goddess pleasure visions into 3D reality. We want to ask spirit to reveal the most grandiose vision of you enjoying your ultimate goddess pleasure along with what's blocking you and what action steps you need to take to step through the gateway where pleasure is one of the five foundations of your goddess life. Now imagine that you're walking outside onto the grass. As you look up at the sky, a golden beam of sparkling light shoots down to consume your entire being. This powerful pillar of light pulses all around you and through you, glowing like a crown of light above you, then pouring its warm golden glow like a shower of light into your head, cascading down your throat, through your chest, your arms, and out your fingertips, extending into your abdomen, then surging down your legs and shooting tiny bolts from your feet into the ground. Envision this light shooting from your tailbone into the earth, through the mud, rocks, and water, then anchoring to the core of Mother Earth. Now imagine that this pillar of light is surging up from the center of Earth, through your body and up into the infinity of sky and space. As this luminescent beam pulsates up and down, creating a crystalline column of light anchored in the earth and plugging you into the infinite energy of the universe, you are the connecting point between heaven and earth with your heart at the very center. Now in your heart space, envision someone you love more than anyone. Savor that feeling of pure love and joy. See the light shower pouring through you and illuminating that love, expanding it outward from your heart, filling your entire body, then bursting into a joyous bubble around you. Imagine this love brightening the light inside your body, illuminating every cell. See this light that's infused with love going into every cell in your body like tiny sparkles, burning away any bacteria, toxins, viruses, or mutations. See that light and love restoring every cell in your body to perfect health and repairing your DNA to perfection. Again, see this love and light 
shooting like laser beams into your cells to deactivate and destroy any toxins, bacteria, viruses, and mutations, restoring every cell to immaculate health. Imagine this sparkling bright light from heaven pulsing through your veins and arteries, purifying your blood, your muscles, and your bones. See it surging up into your brain, where it makes your synapses fire with perfect precision, restoring and maintaining optimum chemical balance for your mental health and enabling all your body functions to operate in perfect synchronicity. See the love and light illuminating your brain's left lobe, right lobe, pineal gland, prefrontal cortex, reticular activating system, subconscious mind, brainstem, and your spinal cord. Now, this light infused with love expands through your skull, your scalp, into your hair, then into your eyes and ears to protect your vision and hearing. Next, this cleansing light flows into your respiratory system to infuse your nose, mouth, throat, and lungs with supernatural immunity. Yes, your respiratory system is filled with this beautiful and powerful light, making you immune to any bacteria, toxins, viruses, or mutations. Next, this light cascades into your heart, where it heals both heartache and physical ailments. See this light flowing into your stomach, pancreas, gallbladder, spleen, liver, kidneys, intestines, and reproductive organs. Witness how this light floods your nervous system, your adrenal glands, your lymph nodes, even your fat, before it expands outward to restore your skin to perfect health. See this light glowing around you, then circling the entire world with peace and love to bless every person with nourishment, safety, shelter, education, clean air, clean water, freedom of speech, freedom of religion, and all good things. See this light making the leaders of the countries doing good things for the people and the planet while Mother Earth is restored to her majestic glory. Then see the light swirling back to your home country, blessing every person with peace and love, safety, equality, and justice. Then see this light surrounding your loved ones like tiny tornadoes of light that infuse them with supernatural immunity while creating a force field of supernatural protection around each one. See their faces glowing with health and happiness. Now see all that light pouring into the top of your head like a shower of golden sparks cascading through you and washing over the energy field around and within your body. Feel this light clearing away negative energy and opening the channels to connect to the universal field of knowledge and the divine while boosting your immunity and cultivating wellness in mind, body, and spirit. See this light pooling at your tailbone, swirling around your ruby red root chakra. Spirit, please cleanse and clear our root chakras to empower our ability to survive and thrive with courage and success in physical, sexual, and financial health, which all enhance and intensify our goddess pleasure. The tone is LAM. Inhale and say it with me. The tone will create a vibration that is a sound bath that clears the energy of your root chakra. Imagine that this sound bath is removing any smudges, smog, 
or dimness around your ruby red root chakra while making it spin and circulate its powerful energy through your entire being. Inhale and say it with me. La. Above our now glowing and spinning ruby red root chakra and below the navel is the orange sacral chakra. It represents creativity and sensuality. Spirit, please cleanse and clear our sacral chakras so that we may enjoy emotional balance, creativity, sensual bliss, and our infinite goddess pleasure. The tone is VAM. Inhale and say it with me. Imagine that this sound bath is removing any smudges, smog, or dimness around your orange sacral chakra while making it spin and circulate its powerful energy through your entire being. Now let's inhale and say it with me. Next, our yellow solar plexus chakra above the navel rules personal power in action. Spirit, please cleanse and clear our yellow solar plexus chakras to empower us to confidently and courageously take aggressive action every day to enjoy our goddess pleasure. The tone is Ram, R-A-M. Inhale and chant it with me. Imagine that this sound bath is removing any smudges, smog, or dimness around your yellow solar plexus chakra while making it spin and circulate its powerful energy through your entire being. Let's inhale and say Ram together. Inhale. Next is the emerald green heart chakra at the center of your chest, and it rules unconditional love and healing. Spirit, please cleanse and clear our heart chakras so that we can give and receive unconditional love and healing and enjoy goddess pleasure in romance and love free of inhibitions and unhindered by hurts of the past. The tone is YAM, Y-A-M. Inhale and say it with me. Imagine that this sound bath is removing any smudges, smog, or dimness around your emerald green heart chakra while making it spin and circulate its powerful energy through your entire being. Inhale and say YAM with me. Above that is the turquoise throat chakra, which rules communication. Spirit, please cleanse and clear our throat chakras to empower our ability to express our highest truth with courage and confidence to demand honesty from others, and to express our wildest desires to experience our ultimate goddess pleasure. The tone is hum. Inhale and chant it with me. Imagine that this sound bath is removing any smudges, smog, or dimness around your turquoise throat chakra while making it spin and circulate its powerful energy through your entire being. The tone is HAM, H-A-M. Inhale and say it with me. Hum. 
Next, your purple third eye chakra is located between your eyebrows and it rules intuition. Spirit, please cleanse and clear our third eye chakras to empower our ability to see into the divine realm and get a clear view of our goddess pleasure vision along with guidance on how to remove obstacles and manifest our wildest desires as we build our personal and professional empires. The tone is sham, S-H-A-M. Inhale and say it together. As we do, imagine that this sound bath is removing any smudges, smog, or dimness around your purple third eye chakra while making it spin and circulate its powerful energy through your entire being. Let's all inhale and say sham. Inhale. Shaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
rather than from your imagination. So listen, observe, and allow the experience to unfold. As the light beam surrounds you, call out to your spirit guide to escort you. This guide may show up as a powerful spiritual being such as the Egyptian goddess Isis. An angel may wrap you in their wings. A unicorn may invite you to get on its back. An ancestor may take your hand. Your, your spirit animal may show up to guide you, symbolizing characteristics that you need to adopt, such as a lion teaching you courage or an eagle showing you how to soar above the ordinary and look at the big picture. In your mind, greet your spirit guide and thank them in advance for escorting you into the spiritual dimensions. Then state your intention. Please show me the details of my goddess pleasure vision, what's blocking me from experiencing it, and the action steps I need to take to manifest it in my physical reality. Then state your intention. Spirit, please show me the details of my goddess pleasure vision. Please also show me what's blocking me from experiencing it and show me the action steps that I need to take to manifest it in my physical reality. Next, allow your spirit self to detach from your physical body and ascend up this beam with your guide. As you ascend, know that you are safe and surrounded by an army of angels. You may feel a floaty sensation, just keep going. And just as an airplane passes through a layer of clouds as it ascends toward the infinity of sky and space, you also pass through a lavender veil that separates the divine dimensions and the physical world. So feel yourself gently floating up, up, light as a feather, up this golden beam with your spirit guide, until you land in your power spot. That's the unique space where you land upon arriving in the divine realms. With your spirit guide at your side, know that this experience is different for everyone. There's no right or wrong. You may see, hear, feel, or simply know new information that comes in the form of spoken words, images, feelings, symbols, and scenes as if they're playing on a divine movie screen. Likewise, you may enter into a vivid world that looks like outer space, a garden, an enchanted forest, or even a golden palace in the clouds. Be open to whatever you experience. Next, ask Spirit, please show me my goddess pleasure vision, along with what's blocking me from experiencing it, and the action steps I need to take to manifest it in my physical reality. The spiritual being or beings that show up to help you may take you somewhere, to a throne, an altar, a forest, a floaty place in space, a house, or anywhere. You may hear words, see symbols, or be shown visions. Ask questions. Listen. When the interaction concludes, thank God and all the angels or other beings who helped you. Now I'm going to give you some time to journey in the divine realm and learn what you need to know to bring your goddess pleasure vision to life.
All right, it's time to thank the divine beings who showed up to help you. Make sure you imprint everything in your mind so you can remember it and write about it when you come out of meditation. With your spirit guide, make your way back to your power spot. From there, slide down the golden beam of light, ever so gently, floating like a feather in the breeze. Just as the airplane passes through the layer of clouds to return to Earth, you pass through the lavender veil that separates the divine realms from the physical world. Then continue to float down like a leaf in the wind, down, down, back to yourself. Notice the stillness in your body and the slowness of your heartbeat and breathing. Slowly reacclimate to yourself by wiggling your fingers and toes. Take some deep breaths and when you're ready, open your eyes. What did Spirit tell you? Were your questions answered? Did you receive instructions? Notice how you feel now and describe your experience in your Abyss Tribe book, your power journal, in your notebook, laptop, or phone. Make sure you record any action steps that Spirit provided to make your Goddess Pleasure vision real. As you journal, you can also go back and fill in the action steps column in your Abyss Tribe book on the Goddess Pleasure Gateway Worksheet. Spirit will speak through this intuitive writing to let it flow. So let it flow. Don't think about it or process it. Just keep writing until every detail is on the page. Thank you for joining me for this amazing energy clearing and guided meditation with the journaling exercise from the Bis Tribe, where you activate your goddess pleasure by Elizabeth Ann Atkins. That's me, and I'm so honored that you're here to do this powerful exercise with this book series that can help you become the goddess that you're born to be. You can get your copy of the book at twosisterswriting.com as well as anywhere books are sold online in hardcover, paperback, and ebook. You can also order your power journal to activate your goddess pleasure at twosisterswriting.com. And then stay tuned for the next books in the Vis Tribe series, which help you activate your power pleasure, prosperity, protection, and peace, and then you earn your goddess coronation at Sea Castle before you build your empire that you rule from a throne of power wearing a crown of confidence. Please also visit thegoddesspowershow.com where you can read the blog, connect to episodes of the audio and video podcast, join the Goddess Roundtable membership community, and learn how I can help you write your own books in my Women Writing Books coaching program. I'm Elizabeth Ann Atkins, and I'm so grateful that you're here in the Biz Tribe to activate your goddess pleasure. My mission is to help you live bigger, better, and bolder to manifest your heart's wildest desires. You can do it, goddess, because you have the power. And now you have the pleasure. <laughs> Please share this video with anybody you think can benefit from it. Please subscribe to the channel or download the recording if you're listening to the audio version. And know that you are an infinite divine being who has the power to make magic happen in your life.